going camping next week and I thought I'd bone up on my fire making skills. And I've never been able to uh, do the one where you carve a V in the wood and push a stick in there. And I think it's called a plow or the one where you have a bow drill. I've never been able to do that. So what I'm gonna do is I've got a cotton ball here. Just take a cotton ball, just unroll it like this. Any cotton will work. You can do this with a piece of old t-shirt fabric too, but you have to work a lot harder. That's good to know if you're ever in a jam. And where I got um, this ash from, you need some ash. I got it from that burner over there that I built last year, got wood gasifier. And it's nothing but just ash. Not hot, it's not cheating, you know. Uh, if you don't have access to some old ash, and if you you can probably use sand or other things, but I haven't tried that far yet. So let's just go with what we got and what I know that works here. And normally I carry a little bit of ash in a in my camp out kit. And I'll just sprinkle this ash on here. And then I'm gonna roll it up. I'll move you around a little bit so my big old paws aren't in, in the way. Let's see. Yeah, make sure that's a good view still. Uh, I'd like to have a camera with the viewfinder on the front so I can see if I got y'all in frame or not. So the first couple of times you just want to roll it to get it to tighten it up. And it's going to look pretty much like that. You roll it a couple times with your board or brick or flat stone or you can take your shoe off and put your hand in your shoe so once you get it nice and tight like that we're going to go like this and you're just going to keep on rolling might have to stop and turn directions so it doesn't get too far away from you Should be able to smell it when it starts burning. It's a little humid today, like I said, so it could take a little while longer. Burn. See what it did right there? I think it's hot. Now that piece right there will burn like that for probably burn like that for five minutes. And you can put that in your tinder bundle. <coughs> it's not the best smell in the world. Let's see if I can turn around where the wind's to my back. That thing will ember like that for you know, five, six minutes, depending on how big your cotton ball was. So, you can see it already starting to burn the wood a little bit. And this could save your life or just be a neat party trick or something to keep the kids busy at a camp out to wear them out. I mean, it'll burn for a while. I'm gonna set it down, I'm starting to get a crick in my back. But you can pretty much get the gist of it. It'll, I'm telling you, that thing will burn for a while. I 
as long as you don't blow on it, you, know, you can blow on it, speed it up. Get drop that in a tin can and walk with it for a little while, but that'll get you where you need to be on a cold day. If you don't have a match or a lighter, can't do a bow drill like me or the wood plow. So I changed sides and it's already blowing all over my fresh clothes. I got a lunch date with my wife today. Yeah, I don't have a zoom or I could zoom it in, but sometimes it's good that GoPro cameras don't have zoom so people don't zoom in and out too much like some kind of a TV commercial. I uh, appreciate y'all watching. Hope this helps you. Hope you never get in a situation where it needs to save your life, but at least you know how to do it. Y'all have a good day.